Come on. Come on, Oski Broski. Come on. Ooh. Come on. Wow. You sack of garbage. Come on. You're in the boat? He's in the boat! Oh my gosh! That's great! That was fantastic! Oh man, I am glad I was recording that garbage. United States Aviator, and today we're, we're starting here at a little bit of a desk, right? Right? Look at that. I love it. I'm loving this. I'm loving, uh, I got a lot to show off this time. Uh, I've been doing a lot of interior decorating. Yes, I have. Um, with a lot of that, I finally, I don't know if last time I finished the towers or not, but the towers are done. Just like the actual towers themselves. All the stone is done until I feel like adding more. But for right now, I'm pleased. This room, I think, is finally completely put together. It's just my my little starting area. I'll start at this desk every time and I'll be like, good day, good people. Your United States Aviator is back. Like I just did. Like I just did. But we have all this. We're back on Tribescraft. And, um, I guess we're gonna keep showing off. Um, quite a bit has happened since the last episode. Uh, we got ourselves a nice little- oh, there's food! My fellow fairy food! The food fairy! Um, but we have a enchantment table. I'm gonna add a couple chests there. Once I find some nether rack, not nether rack, nether, not nether quartz, not nether wart. There we go. That'll be that. Um, I think I have decided that I'm just gonna have ladders going up for the top, for the upper two. I guess the upper three, and then there's stairs going down for the final one. Um, in terms of going up and down, you can just kind of slide off wherever you want. That. Yeah, this is where the stairs are. Well, I don't really want them at the entrance there. But the way that this room is situated, they're going to have to kind of be there, unless I want them, like, behind there. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. That's not something I'm going to do in this episode, though. Um, still a bunch of storage down there. I might put it, like, right now? Actually, this room is still the leather farming room, because I still need plenty of bookshelves. Um, but once that is done, this room will probably turn into a storage and smelting kind of general necessities floor. Um, this is the starter floor. Upstairs is the brewing floor, and the place above that is the fishing floor. Because that's where I move my fishing mechanism, because you see it's not in here anymore. Because it was just kind of, kind of out of place when you think about it. Not even really out of place, it wasn't centered, and that was that's what was really bothering me, is what I realized. And then instead of doing that, I kind of just Whoa, how did you get down here? Slick Rick. That means I must have, like, a 7 light level in here somewhere. Also, the sword is pretty good, pretty good. We have quite a bit of things. Um, all the windows I'm working on in this room, I think they're done in this room. I'm pleased with that. Downstairs here, I got rid of the cobblestone generator and put my bed down here. This is just gonna be a bedroom. I have to show off the door and the doorbell. Oh my goodness, there was so much stuff that has happened in between episodes. Jeez Louise. <clears throat> All right, so down there's that, and I'll save that for last because I need to be outside for that. Because I think it's pretty nifty. This is still another room. I'm gonna spruce this up a little bit later. Uh, and then upstairs, you already saw, that's the farming area. I haven't rebuilt the path passageway. Passageway up there because it's going to be ladders up. And now that I know the stairs are going to cause me some trouble in the future, it'll probably definitely be ladders up. And it'll just be better that way. Right, I said there would be four chests around there. And I guess a cauldron? No, not a cauldron. What I kind of want is... Whoa, we got some heavy rain just now. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but wow. Out of nowhere, too. I'd say summer rains, but it's October. But let me tell you, for where I am, 
on the East Coast, Middle East Coast in Virginia, it feels so summer-like, and I hate it with a passion. So hopefully this will just bring in some nice, cool autumn weather, because if it doesn't, I'm probably going to sweat into a puddle and you'll never see me again. Um, but that's just about it. There's a line there. I might add, like, some splash of window designs, like... Kinda not polka dot, not completely random because it'll be the same on the other side, but um, kind of, kind of uh, just dots of windows around this little area. Um, but I am sticking with the four design, these four colors: white, gold, magenta, and purple. I think that's gonna be my color scheme for this entire oh why are you on the roof Calm, i guess i need to light up my roof too geez louise calm down where's my bow i don't see oh, okay i see you i have to walk around you shouldn't blow up but i do need to light up the roof thank you for uh reminding me creeper that the roof needs to be lit up you're probably dead um also what happened is i got that little achievement by shooting a skeleton from over 50 meters. That was fun. That's what I also decided I want to do. I want to oh, that was almost bad. do every single advancement. They're not achievements anymore. So I'll do that eventually. Have every potion effect applied at the same time? Jesus! I can brew a potion. That's fine. Um, God... How do you even do that? I guess they all have to be... Splash potions would be the easiest, I guess. Do they count wither as a potion effect? Because you can't craft a potion of withering. So you'd have to go into the nether. Yeah, I don't even know. We'll figure that out later. But, uh, breed animals, breed all of them. Haven't done that yet. I still need another pig. I think I've bred, I've bred sheep. Balanced diet, eat everything, even if it's not good for you. I still need to do that. Um, serious dedication. Completely use up a diamond hoe. I could... I'm not going to do that all in this episode. I could do that, because I did make a diamond hoe. Because I found out that that was an advancement. Um, what else do we got? Kill one of every hostile mob. I think that might include the ender dragon. So, I also want to know if, like, doing damage during a team fight is enough to get that advancement. Or do... I personally have to kill it. Uh, use the Totem of Undying, which means I have to go and find one of those woodland mansions. Um, now, are they counting zombie pigmen as a hostile mob? Are they counting zombie pigmen and angry dog as hostile mobs? That's a question that I have to look up. Or you can tell me in the comments. Um... I know where our village is, so I can do this easily. Um, I know where our village is, so I can do that easily. That's two that I could actually do this episode. That might be what this episode is for. Um, adventuring time, discover every biome. Jeez Louise. And then this one. Oh, oh I don't know why. I, have, I don't have a shield yet. I need to make one. Um, weaken and then cure a zombie villager. I could do that. I have plenty of golden apples, and if I run out, I can make many, many more. Uh, follow an eye ender. That's fine. Enter the end portal. That's fine. I already know where the end portal is, so I can do this. Every single enderman that I've killed has not given me a freaking ender pearl, which makes me furious. <laughs> but I now have a looting three on this diamond sword. Yes. So hopefully that'll be a little bit easier. And I think that was all the advancements. Yeah. Yeah, that's all. So I think today... We're going to try and do this here, successfully trade with a villager. Ah, advancement. And then the other one was what? Successfully trade and summon an iron golem. So, I don't know if I have pumpkins. So if that's the case, I'll just start pumpkins in the farm upstairs. As soon as I have to build a path to the farm upstairs, which is fine because I'll just need ladders. And I think I have some ladders. I have... Was that a witch? Whatever. 
It sounds like it's down in my animal thing. It needs to shut up, though. Before I molly -wop it. Um... I guess I'll take my boat from after adventure there. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. If I'm trading, I'm gonna need emeralds. Emerald days. I'll take half just in case I die somewhere along the way somehow, even though I'm not super decked out, but I do have Frostwalker and Feather Falling on these boots, and I am so pleased with that. We have to get probably a lot of iron. Is it one, two, three, four, five? No, it's four. I need four iron blocks. So then I only need 36 of these. So, one, two, three, four. I do, I've learned to use the book. At first I've really hated the book, but now I'm, it's kind of grown on me. Um, I have a couple pumpkins, I only need one. Um, I got emeralds. I should be good. I should be good to go. I'm probably not going to use the boat much, because I have feather, not feather falling, frostwalker too. And boy do I love being freaking Jesus. Alright, I showed all, oh, I need to, that's why I need to sleep, because I still have two more things to show you. Alright. I'm just glad there were no creepers. You know what, I'm fine with you. You are okay in my book, Mr. Spider. You can stay out here until next night time, and if you bother me then I will wreck you. Another skeleton? I need to light up this area, now that I think about it. I don't have any torches around the outside. And you know what? If I built that shield, skeletons just would have been like a walk in the park, and I would have gotten that achievement. But, stay alive, you. Boy. Alright. So now that everything over here is dead, for the most part, I can show you the door. The doors, plural. And did I close the door? I hope I closed the door. Better close the door. Yeah, I closed the door. Alright, so first of all, I'm going to show you the two doorbells. And hopefully they don't lag, because when they lag they sound kind of dorky. And when they don't lag, they sound beautiful. And hopefully you can hear them. Click that. Lag a little bit at the end. Can we get one good one? There we go. That one's good. Alright. So, that is... That is Learn to Fly by the Foo Fighters. Because, you know, I'm the aviator and then you have to learn to fly. Alright, and then this one, I expect to lag because it's just so much, but maybe it won't. Let's see. It was a little bit of lag. It was a little bit of lag. And if you've seen, like, my last Skywars episode, uh, or some of my other ones, I occasionally play this song. It's called Glorious Stuff. Yeah, don't you hiss at me. I will murder you. Oh, oh what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Wait, are you gonna- Yeah, I was about to say. I'm gonna let you burn to death. I'm not gonna use any more of my, uh, durability. This is Glorious Domination. Glorious. No, I won't give in. I won't give in. Till I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Good- Good stuff. Good stuff. Those are my two doorbells. Those are the two songs that I chose. But here's how this works. This- door can't be open unless you break this so I advise you not to break um or drop in the secret item that I'm not going to reveal right now and secret item in a secret place but I guess I'll show y'all um so what you have to do is I'm going to just because I'm not going to open it right now but I'll throw in an item that's not the secret item um, something that I don't really care about. You. So, what you do is, you throw this into this corner, and if it is the secret item, the door will open. But since it's not, the door stays closed. And if these were, like, regular blocks too, if you put a lever here, it still wouldn't open, based on the redstone that's underneath the door. Um, so, um, I'm going to do a quick jump cut and get the secret item... I hope it's in my inventory, actually. Um, jump cut. Secret item is in there, and then it opens up. There we go. Just like that. And then from this side, you just lock it. And then it's locked again, and from this side, you can open it. 
And if you don't want to waste a secret item, you can close it again. And there we go. So now you know that it is an item other than seeds, if anyone else is watching. Um, otherwise, you just ring the doorbell and you wait. You hope that I come. But for right now, we are going to head on all the way over to the desert. And hopefully I'll jump cut to it unless something interesting happens along the way. Um, and it is at negative... Because the desert is where I also found the... I have a nice little page of coordinates that I like to keep a track of. Negative 132. Negative 92 something. So, I need to go positive x but negative z, right? Yes, positive x, am I going the right way? I'm going positive x, positive z, positive x, negative z. So this is the correct direction. Come on. Come on, Oski Broski. Come on. Ooh. Come on. Wow. You sack of garbage, come on. You're in the boat? He's in the boat! Oh my gosh! That's great! That was fantastic! Oh man, I am glad I was recording that garbage. Ooh, I'm also glad that creeper didn't sneak up behind me. I don't know where it is, but... Also, that's the gaming area. Um, I really wish it were daytime right now, because I would show it off better. I need to actually build a section of that track. I'll probably do that tonight, really. Yeah, see, look at that. People have, um... There's a pit area. That's fine. They need to really light this up, though. So no mobs spawn here. Uh, there's this area. It goes this direction. This is my area. I lit it up. Okay, it looks like only the pit area has been completed so far now, actually. But I will work on my area very shortly. What did they build theirs out of? Was that black wool or was it coal? Because if it's coal, then I'm just gonna rage. Because I have to find so much coal, but I do have, like, fortune three? Then I don't have to make- oh, they used- oh, that's clever. They used black- Jesus, there's so many creepers around here. I didn't know it was Creeper Village. You guys can walk on my shirt. Come on. Come on. Get wrecked. Get sniped. Get good. Oh, well, you're not even bothering me anymore. Alright, <clears throat> continuing on. I should have cleared out my inventory before I left. I really should have. Um, I'm sure there's a chest here somewhere. If there isn't. I can't even make one. Wow. Alright, well... Here we go. Which villager do I want to trade with? The leather working one, no. I would love to, if one of them's like, I'll trade you like 32 freaking leather for a... No, no, all of these are awful trades, unfortunately, so far. Oh, it's the, the dummy villager. The dunce villager. Oh, sorry. Um, who are you? What do you want? A lot of rotten flesh. That's a good deal since we have a freaking farm, but I'm not going to do that. Seems like an abuse of emeralds, but not really. Um, 30 paper for an emerald, sad. I do have sugar cane with me, if I just wanted to, like, camp here. There is more sugar cane over there, so I think the smart thing to do would be to plant one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10. And once all of those grow, it'll be 30. And then just farm the rest of this. So I'll have 14 extra. Great. It'll be like I never did anything here. Alright. Because I do want to see what kind of book he'll have to offer, but truth be told, it probably won't be anything worth my while. You were cool. I do want to trade... Well, you know what I can do right now is clear out a little bit of inventory space and make an iron golem for this village. I guess you just need to kind of be in the general vicinity. Three, four, and then one block. And you guys are protected. 
Alright, and I could really just steal your book cases right now. It would still be worth it because even though I don't have my you know I wow okay even though I don't have my silk touch axe I can just get the books it'll still drop three um you're a dummy I really don't like calling them dummies but that's what they are they have no trades for me oh there goes food my fairy friend my fairy brother my fairy brethren is there anything in here there's a is it a dummy yeah of course it's a dummy just like a dummy to get trapped in the house with no exit. Just want a 30, right? You want a 30? It's you, right? Yes. You can take all of these, and then you'll be happy. You don't have a... You don't have a freaking another... I was hoping for another trade after that, sir. And you have some suckish trades. I don't even know what you offer after this. You only want things so I can give you emeralds. Bad trades. Get out of my way. Uh, what are you? If I had coal, I would give it to you. No, it's just an iron axe. Why would anyone make that trade? Jesus Christ. So there are two of you. Did you want anything else? Fortune 2 efficiency 3 isn't really a bad shovel. And I really don't intend on using emeralds ag No. No. I'm not doing that, because you're not even a worth it villager after that. You're a dummy. I'm just gonna wait for more sugar cane to grow. That's what I'm gonna do. And there's not a lot anymore. Oh man. Well, I might be back. Gosh, why are none of you going inside of your homes? What is wrong with you all? Jesus. You, you guys know that what happens at night I think I just heard one of them get hit. Hopefully he didn't turn. Gosh, I almost shot him in the face. That's fine. No, 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 no. Aw, dang it. I could have saved him. <sighs> Sad. They're overrun right now. I don't know why none of them are going into their homes. I'm trying to shoot everything but not shoot the villagers. But there's... They're outnumbered right now and I don't know why they're not freaking... Because I can one-hit these almost. Okay, you'll probably burn out. How did you not burn out? I could go down there and I could fight them all. What's the time looking like? It's still close to midnight. See, like, whoever went into their house, good on them. Nope. What are you doing? You hugging a cactus, you stupid villager? Was that a baby? Oh my gosh, there's baby versions of those things? Oh yeah, no, that's not okay. That's not okay. I don't remember what they do. I think the icy ones slow you down. I think those ones make you hungry. Don't quote me on that at all. Gosh, there's like an XP farm here. Wait, I if a spider's coming after me, then I have to pay attention. Because he can knock me right off of my perch. But I think we're... Jesus, why are you all idiots? Let's go in here. Let's hope for a second level enchant that asks for, like... Eight... Uh, freaking... Emeralds. Come on, my boy. Okay. Go ahead. What is this? A compass? Really? Uh, this is a cartographer too, so he could give me a map, and then what I hate to think is that he gives me a map for a sea temple and I know where a sea temple is. Check my recipes. I can make an emerald block. whoop de dang do. Alright, well, in terms of advancements, I think I got two, three maybe? I'm about to get a third one. Let me just, because I know the ender portal is, the end portal is that way, I think. So, wait, where the heck did it go? Oh, wow. Um, that way? 
followed it, right? I followed it. Got to... I'm following it. Do I have to, like, follow it all the way to a freaking... I mean, I can do that. It also has a chance of breaking, though. Go, 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 go. Catch it, catch it. And it broke, of course. Delightful. Delightful. I can make one more. I'd love to get the achievement for freaking making a... For not making an end portal, but finding one, I guess. Because this is leading me away from the other end portal. Yeah, this is going in the positive X direction. So there's another stronghold somewhere. Go, 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 go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Catch it. Of course it breaks on the first freaking... Golly tamale. Alright. <laughs> I think that's all my brain can take right now. Um, I guess I'll see you guys when I'm home. And then we'll go over what the plan is for next time. I guess. Because <laughs> this freaking game freaking screwed me over. But I know now that there's an end portal uh, going this way. So I guess that's something. Something came of all of this. Something came of this suckish village. And while I'm still here, angry, you know what? Maybe that shovel will come in handy now. I think I'm going to buy that shovel. Because I need sand and my shovel's about to break. And I have more emeralds at home. And I have Fortune 3 and I live in Extreme Hills, so it's not going to be fine to find a heart. Hard to find more of the Emeraldes. Yeah, he's dead. That's sad. Yeah, I think he is gone. That is rough. Yeah, he's gone. Rest in peace. Was there a zombie in here? Cause like I hear a zombie. Whatever. Since that's the case, I guess I'm just gonna go home then. So I just traveled in the nether and I realized just how much faster it is. And luckily I found a little bit of nether wart so I can start planting it. There, 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 and there. Which means I can do some more things next episode. Um, found some blue orchid, which means I can make some light blue dye, even though I can have made light blue dye with some lapis and some other things. But, we're gonna go back down to our lovely little ending sectional. We're gonna talk about what we did, what we're gonna do, do the best fairy we can. So we're about to get into some real magical mumbo jumbo. Alright. So, what do we do today? We'll even take off some of this armor so we can see this beautiful breast cancel and wearing this pink jacket and shirt and goggles. And goggles. So today, we achieved some more advancements. Which ones did we get? Uh, we got, what a deal. We summoned an iron golem. What is this one? Discover every biome. Okay. I thought it was like, jump on your button. I was like, I've done that plenty of times. Um, kill one of every hostile mob. That increased because we killed the special zombies, which apparently count as different mobs. Um, hopefully, once we go back to that desert, we can hopefully trade with that cartographer again. We'll take some emeralds with us just in case he's expensive. And hopefully, 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 he'll give us a map that leads us to a mansion instead of a underwater temple. 
Uh, I don't think we did anything here. We followed an Eye of Ender, but apparently not far enough. Um, we'll do that. We'll do that next time. Deflect an arrow. In fact, we'll make a shield while we end this episode. Um, we can do that now that I can make potions. That'll be what we do next episode. We'll weaken and cure a zombie villager. And if we can do it close to our house and have him, like, live here, I'm great with that. That sounds phenomenal. Um, I don't think we did anything here. I haven't killed a gas with a fireball. I've killed many gas, but I've just been bowing them. Use the nether to travel seven kilometers. How many blocks is a kilometer? I'll come back with that information next time. Um, brew a potion, that'll be next time too, because I'll have some nether stuff. Some nether wart growing in all of those corners. That is going to be a work in progress, and I need to figure out which potions apply for that. Okay, it says have every single potion effect. So, wither is not a potion effect. Which means we need the weakness ones too? Interesting. Interesting. Um, but I think we can do that too. Um, maybe not next episode, but who knows. Um, obtain a skull. We can try and... We'll have a whole nether episode. Uh, summon the wither. <laughs> we'll have a whole nether episode. Let's see, let's see. I might actually do the wither with some people. We'll see. Um, serious dedication. I'll start working on that. Uh, eat everything. I really don't know what I have eaten and what I haven't eaten and breed animals. It's gonna be tough. Some of these are tough. This one especially. I guess kill one of every hostile monster does mean the wither, so the wither episode will help that out. I don't know if I've killed a skeleton. I've killed a blaze. I don't know if I've killed a wither skeleton. I know I've shot one, I just don't know if it died or not. I think it fell into lava and they don't do fire tick damage. But that's all of the advancements we did this time. We got some ender pearls. We got some books, thank God. And I think that's it. And this is probably going to be a lengthier episode because a lot happened and it's been probably about like an hour and some change of recording. But this has been your United States Aviator, the King of Kings, the Fairy of Fairies. And I'm taking off telling you to stay classy, passengers, and I will see you all in the next video. Toodaloo!